Assalamu alaikum guys how are you i hope you are doing good and finally we got the android 11 custom rom for our redmi note 8 this is the vanilla build this is the first build of android 11 for redmi note 8 and note 8t so in this video we will talk about the bugs and issues and what's working what's not working and i will also show you full review plus installation of this rom so Without any further ado, let's get started. So the ROM is pretty stable and uh, almost everything is working fine as you can see here. Wi-Fi, mobile data, Bluetooth and Wi-Fi calling, hotspot, flashlights everything is working and i al already added a list of what's working and what's not working in the description you can check and uh, in the bugs here we have the wi-fi display and adb over usb permissible ac linux and safety net is not working so i think these are not the major bugs and everyone can go without them so other than that the rom is pretty stable and useful it is working pretty much awesome without any lag or issue in the camera we have this simple camera pre-installed with picture and video modes uh, there is no any mode of portrait and slow motion or other modes but don't worry you can install any gcam camera mode from the link in the description you can even install the gcam 7.3 with the auxiliary camera mode and it will work fine the overall performance of this rom is also good as you can see here uh, the app opening speed is also good it is opening the apps quickly and uh, animations are played very well no lag no glitches in the ui as you can see here now let's talk about the new features there are a lot of new features added in the android 11 as you can see here we have the media player control in the quick settings like if you are playing any music or watching any youtube video or listening to spotify or google play music and you can simply control the music from the quick settings as you can see here you can manage more than one applications from right here as you can see here and the first one is working the google play music and setting uh, second one is the youtube as you can see here you can swipe to switch and uh, it will work fine if you want to change the speaker then just click on the phone speaker and it will show you a pop-up to add another device where you want to play this music as you can see here so this is a really pretty amazing feature of this rom but if you re remove the notification from the notification panel uh, even then you can get it from the quick settings by extended the quick settings as you can see here and you can continue listening to any music or broadcast so that's a thumbs up to the android 11 the volume panel style is not changed in this rom I don't know why it should be changed and in the power menu you can see the major difference here we have emergency power of advance and here you can add the cat controls you can add the water bubbles food and the toys for the cat and it will work fine you just have to click on the save button after checking them After it the new feature is that bubble notifications as you can see here here we got the notification and here we have the bubble of this notification which is pretty much uh, similar to the Facebook's messenger and it's really cool you can add more bubbles by clicking on the bubble plus button so if you want to close it just drag and drop at the bottom so this is also a good feature and in the recent we have uh, a new useful feature which is called the screenshot if you want to take a screenshot of any application which is in the recent just click on the screenshot and it will take a screenshot of that screen 
so from here you can change the color profile you can manage the colors and lighting you can crop it and you can uh, draw everything on it like you can make doodles and you can also edit it in the third party applications so that's a good feature the second option from the recent here we have the share option you can uh, directly share any screenshot from right here to any application or any contact saved in your phone and as you can see here the gaming performance of this ROM is also good uh, the PUBG mobile is working pretty much fine without any lag or issue everything is working fine you can play any game like Asphalt 8, PUBG Mobile, Call of Duty and it will work fine. Now let's dig into the settings. In the settings first of all we have search, network, internet, connected devices, apps and notification, battery. The battery performance of this ROM is also really amazing. Literally it's amazing. Here we have battery saver, battery manager and battery percentage for the quick settings. Then we have display. Here we have brightness level, night light, adaptive brightness, wallpaper and uh, screen timeout, font size, display size, lock screen settings and the lock screen settings we also have the always on display which is named by always show time and info and it is working fine then we have uh, tap to wake which is working fine and then we have dark theme, accent color and you can also change the font styles and you can also change the icon shape, icon shape and icon pack from right here after it we have the sound, the sound quality of this ROM is also pretty amazing because we have uh, the pre-installed Mi sound enhancer in this ROM which will be helpful to enhance the sound quality and after it we have the privacy, storage, location and in the security the fingerprint is working fine we don't have the face unlock in this ROM but the fingerprint is working pretty much fine it is unlocking the device quickly as you can see here after it we have the location, accessibility, detail well-being, Google, Xiaomi parts and then we have the system in the system we have languages and input gestures and the gestures first of all we have the quickly open camera by double pressing the power button then we have system navigation here we have three button navigation bar and navigation gestures from here you can change the intensity unfortunately you can uh, you can not disable the navigation bar pill then we have the power menu which is uh, coming with the new look as you can see here you can add the controls and you can edit the controls for cat feature then we have date and time backup reset option updater then we have the about phone from here you can check the android version which is the 11 and its security patch is 5 september 2020 the rom is pretty stable and uh, it can be used as daily driver if you don't care about some minor bugs uh, so now let's move to the installation of this ROM to install Android 11 custom ROM on your Redmi Note 8 first of all you need to download the ROM and GApps from the link in the description and reboot your device into an installed custom recovery go to wipe click on advanced wipe and wipe everything except the internal storage do not select internal storage and SD card wipe everything from right here after wiping go back click on install and now locate your downloaded android 11 rom here we have the osip inco 11 flash it right from here you can also install this rom on your redmi note 8t velo device after installing the rom click on home button again go to the install now locate your downloaded G apps from the link in the description and uh, click on it and flash it right from here do not use the open G apps uh, use the Nick G apps download it from the link in the description 
after installing it go back and you can also root it by flashing the super su uh, if you want to root your android 11 just download the super su from the link description and flash it from the custom recovery and then go to boot and click on reboot system if you want to uh, if you don't want to root then do not flash it in the super user zip file and on the first boot it's gonna take two to three minutes only so wait now as you can see here the rom has been successfully booted up and uh, now let's go into the settings to check its android version go to settings scroll down go to about phone click on android version and boom the android 11 custom rom has been installed on your device so this was the video of how you can install it on your redmi note note 8 or note 8t so hope you guys like this video if you really did hit the like button don't forget to subscribe my channel and make sure you press the bell icon so you never miss any future update